Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Cheryl Technology Channel. As always, my name is Chris. If it's your first time here, like, comment, subscribe if you so desire. If you do not, that's fine, too. It is totally up to you. Um, in this video, we are going to be playing on a Mac in Warzone. Now, some of you may be thinking, but wait, Chris, that's not even possible. Well, it kind of is. I'm not sure why my button is backing up. I'm not sure. You see that? Is everybody, am I the only one that just saw that? So in this video, that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be playing Warzone on a Mac. Now, the way we're doing this is Shadow PC. I'm not, disclaimer, I am not sponsored by them, nor do I really like their service. It's all right, but it has its issues like latency. Um, the biggest thing is that they have, now this may fix it because it didn't do this before. What, what's been happening is every time I try to run a game in Shadow PC, it the latency is about 55 milliseconds or so. So as y'all can, as y'all know, in a video game, 55 seconds is a lot. So it's got a GTX 1080, uh, 12 gig of RAM, and I forget the processor. I don't really recall. So 30 is the normal price for the low tier. They have two tiers of shadow machine PCs you can use. The second tier, I believe, is a, and this is what it looks like. The second tier is a uh, GT or an RTX. It says unstable connection, but I have 500 meg up and down at my house. So I don't know what in the crap it's talking about. Oh, great. It's starting an update. Basically, that's kind of how it is. It is a, and it, I mean, I'm, I'm not going to, it's pretty snappy, man. It really is. So I just, I mean, I wanted to show y'all kind of what it looked like, what, it, how it is, how it reacts, how it functions. Now I am running on Wi-Fi because my stupid, uh, oh God, this is going to take forever. Basically my connection, I've got a dock, but the dock has not been working the ethernet for some reason. This, this is a good, it's a good idea, but I think the implementation needs to be more broad. That's what I'm curious about. Boy, it is slow, dude. Look how laggy that thing is. Okay, we're going to let the shaders get done, and I'm going to be right back. Okay, y'all, we just ran into another problem. The lost connection to Shadow PC. You know what? doesn't freaking shock me, y'all. It really doesn't. Do you want to use disconnect the other device? Yes, I want to do that. It's the same device, you goofy sucker. Good Lord. You know what? We're not even going to bother with the... Let's go down to... Uh... Let's go to Resurgence. We're going to do the singular ones, and let's just get... Oh, there you go. It's going to lock up again. Oh, my goodness, dude. This is like, I can see the lag. Like, this is supposed to be flawless, but it's not. Yeah, my king calls this game is a performance issue. It is a performance problem. So, as y'all can see, I mean, like, I've had, so in case anybody wants to add me as a friend, there's my gamer tag. Wet loco, y'all. Wet loco. That's me. But that's basically what I'm finding is that the lagginess and stuff, it's like got too much, like it looks good here, but when you start playing, it's a lot of lagginess. It's bad. Every time I've played, I've played like three, four times, and it's been, it's been unplayable every time, which is kind of the point of this. But there, the other side of this is that, let's say you're wanting to run applications on it or something like that. It would be perfect for that. You could buy like some little thin, like a little NUC or something, a little Intel NUC, like a little low power machine for like three, 400 bucks. And you could run one of these, pay the monthly fee, and it would be pretty good for that. But there's actually another program for that too. And it's called um, Chasm. So Chasm will run like applications inside of a virtual environment. I've got videos on that in case you want to go look at my channel. Okay, let's see what happens, y'all. Let's see if this works. Let's see. I'm curious. Let's see what happens, y'all. Let's see what happens. You're up fast. We're about that was to get evil. Quick, that wasn't bad. Not bad at all. Oh, there's the leggy. See it? Done, bro. Enemy soldier incoming. Oh my god, this is so bad. 
That was bad. Y'all see that? Woo, that was terrible. Okay, so I'm going to pause this and preload the shader real quick. Then we'll be back. Okay, so I tried to restart the shaders. They never started, so we're just going to have at it. We're just going to have at it. See what we got, y'all. Good Lord, dude, this thing is like... How come it doesn't tell Enemies me? Enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Check your gear and weapons. We'll be deploying shortly. Oh my goodness. Y'all are seeing this, right? See, and that's not what I saw. Hey, y'all. I'm going to end it right there. I'm going to end it right there. I'm done. I'm tired of looking at this ugly thing. So that's the end of the video, y'all. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe. My recommendation to you is to not get Shadow PC yet because it is not ready. It is literally not ready for deployment. It has got so far to go. But I believe if they really work at it, they can get it because I think it has great potential. Um, and I've got one more thing to tell you. If you have not accepted Jesus Christ your Savior, I pray that you would like, comment, subscribe on this video. And if you have any questions about Jesus, just send me an email. It's in my, it's in my, uh, on my channel. My email is in the about me section. And uh, just send an email to that and I will help you. I will definitely help you. If you need help with something else, just let me know. I'll be glad to help you. Anyway, y'all, that's all the video. Thank y'all for watching, like, comment, subscribe. And until the next video, everybody, peace. As this guy right here is saying, peace. Well, it's kind of not peace, but it is. Thank y'all. Bye, y'all.